What's up, you two? Simply unlucky here, and it's time for some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links! And then I want to ask you guys to check out the channel and subscribe for some more epic Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. And remember, we're trying to do a Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links uh, episode every day, and also you guys check out the other TCG content we're doing for Yu-Gi-Oh! Because it's epic and it's awesome. Alright, you guys, so... Today is a quick video, not a quick video, but something randomly happened, and they created, they came out with a new pack, but they also came out with 33 million downloads, 333, 33,333,333, there we go. So we all get Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, Neo the Magic Swordsman, Yami, and then 500 gems, receive all. That's pretty cool. Um, I like that. Also, something else I wanted to do while you guys were here. Um, some interesting card trader cards. I don't think I'm too interested in those at the moment. So we're going to go for conversion here. And Because uh, you guys haven't really seen me. Um, I've been doing a lot of stuff in the background here. I just haven't had much time to upload videos as often as I'd like of this. Um, but here's our batch convert. You guys ready for this? Um, yeah. 212,550. Oh, uh, that's hilarious. Okay. So, we've now batch converted. We have lots of lots of gold. Uh, we want to save our Ultra Rare and Super Rare tokens at the moment. I still am going to need to batch those. Um, we're not going to do that on video because that will take days. Uh, but yes, so this video will be about the wonders of the sky. Alright, so for the sale that's going on right now that I was thinking about participating in for you guys, it would just be a fun thing to do for videos. A little investment for Simply and Lucky, I guess. Um, so I was going to do one video where we do, I think, is that 60, 75 packs? 15, 25, um, 71 packs. So we're going to do 71 packs for this video. And then I was going to do another video with uh, the 60 packs. And so we're going to do go all out with this new, new box here, the Wonders of the Sky. And uh, to take a quick look at the box here. So let's go in. Wonders of the Sky mini box. Um, there's two ultra ultra rare cards, and then there is um, super rares. There are so the ultras is atmosphere and desert twister. So for this video, you guys, I want to talk about this set. It's going to be a little longer. We're gonna we're gonna understand these cards because I've played the TCG since it came out in 2002, English anyways, and so I actually kind of know what all these cards do already, and so it's interesting. I think the goal with this. Um, Wonders of the Skybox is obviously they're releasing some Wing Beast stuff, but it's a lot of removal um, type cards. And so you'll see here all these uncommons, we'll go over them in a minute here, but are all removal type cards. So um, usually when we open the packs, we go over the effects kind of thing, but I just want to go over it real quick, do like a general discussion, uh, take a few minutes. So first we got Atmosphere. Um, we'll talk about it if we pull it more, but basically this card's actually pretty good. I got it. We got in a booster box battle one time we were doing it, and it gets special summoned by removing two monsters you control and one monster in your grave, and then once per turn you can do a relinquish type effect and equip uh, one monster they control to this card, and it gains attack and defense equal to the equipped monster. So, and it only can equip to face up, so you can only grab the face up monsters they have. So it's pretty cool though, because it's already a thousand thousand eight hundred, so it can become an easily you know two thousand three thousand plus attack monster. So this card is pretty good. Um, you definitely might want to just play one in most of your decks, especially if you're able to get out monsters quick. Um, maybe not something that revolves around a certain effect like uh, dinosaurs. You may not want to do it because you're tributing them a lot for your uh, with your uh, to order to charge. I always forget the exact name of it. Whatever. Um, but the point is, yeah, if you're using a deck that has a certain combo, you may not want to use this, but just in a general deck, this is definitely a good card. So you can play one. Desert Twister is a Chaos Sorcerer for Wind and Earth. Yep. So it can't be special summon. Normal summon set it can only be special summon by removing play one Earth and two Wind from your grave. Once per turn, discard a card, destroy a spell card on the field. That's pretty bad. It should be once per turn, destroy one spell drop card on the field. You can destroy one spell drop. Not, you shouldn't have to discard for it. But you could combo off of the discard, so... Um, but yeah, so it's a Chaos Sorcerer for win and Earth, but you have to remove two win. And then, so we go to Super Rares, awesome, Skilled Red Magician. This is the uh, Summon Skull uh, Skilled Magician. And so Skilled Red says here, each time a spell card is activated, place a spell counter, three max. You can attribute this card with three spell counters to special summon a Archfiend monster from your hand, deck, or grave. Summon Skull is an Archfiend monster. And then banish this card to place a spell counter on a spell card that you control. So a really cool card. I like that they threw this in the game because this is this is a great idea. I would have done the same thing if I was them. So very cool. Skilled Red Magician. Um, Disc Blader is a 1700 attack monster here. 
Uh, once per turn, target one normal trap in the grave, banish the target if you do the gang's 500. So he's an easy 2200 potentially. So definitely not a bad card. And he's also a win fiend. So if you have Yami, so if you're playing Yugi's deck, all of a sudden you got a 1900 that has potential to be 24. So this guy is extraordinary for Yami. If you're playing Yugi's, so start the game with uh, Yami on the field. Uh, Birdface, uh, 1600 plus 200 because you play the uh, Harpy's Hunting Ground. It's 1800. I, I think I see it this being in most Harpy decks, at least one or two. Easy. When it's sent to the grave, as a result of Battle, goes search Harpy out. But it's still, it's 1800 beat six, so it's, it's great. Uh, I don't like Adesis of Explosive very much. Um, Summit Skull. So here's the Summit Skull. They have Summit Skull in the pack. This is freaking incredible. I love Summit Skull. Um, I remember when I first started playing the card game. And most of you guys know the story, but first pack I got um, uh, Harpy's Lady Sisters in my first pack, and my cousin got a starter deck, and so she had Summit Skull, and I was like, I'll give you my Harpy Lady Sisters for your Summit Skull, and she was like, heck yeah. So, yeah, Summit Skull. It's the first card I traded for. Um, but yeah, very awesome. This card's always treated, treated as an Archfiend. And Black School Drive, the same concept, so he's in here too. Really good cards though, Big Bang Shot, incredible. Uh, most decks will play this card just because if you have room for it, incredible. 4,000 attack. If you're comboing with Banished Monsters, when this card leaves the field, Banish the Equipped Monster. So there's that combo there. Um, but yeah, 400 attack and Piercing Effect, incredible. Uh, Rising Energy, the life points are 4,000. And you have a card here that says Discard 1 card, Target 1 face a monster field against 1,500 attack until the end phase. What? What? That's incredible. So, uh, I don't know how useful it'll be, but still, that seems pretty crazy. Uh, but yeah, definitely Big Bang Shot will be extraordinary. And for the rares, um, we'll kind of go over it as we open them, I think. That'd be the best way to do that. Same with the commons. Um, but <laughs> look at this white boy. I, that picture has always gotten me whenever I saw that card. <laughs> it's just like, hey. <laughs> uh, okay. And that wacky magic is in here. Oh, man. That wacky magic. Uh, but this card's actually decent for Duel Links. Uh, banish all spell cards from your graveyard, so you're playing a lot of spells. Easy. Destroy all face of monster opponent controls with defense less than or equal to the number of spells times 300. So you banish five spells, that's 1,500. You destroy all their monsters with 1,500 or less. That's crazy. Um, and then, ooh, Shrine of Mist Valley is good, too. Unicorn Beacon's not bad if you're doing banished monsters uh, for Beast Warrior and Wing Beast. And, yeah. Um, and then, obviously, other card to note is Magician Black Chaos. Is in so, let's get started with the pack opening. All right, you guys, first... Three packs and guaranteed super rare card. Localized Tornado. Shuffle all cards from the hand of the deck into the deck. Hand engraved into the deck. Transforming Sphere. Shrine of Mist Valley. Nice. And remember, you guys, Prismatic Glossy, super rare, or ultra rare cards. Here we go. Uh, combo Master. Return of the Soul. <laughs> I didn't talk about that card. Ooh, we started Magician of Black Chaos. Nice. And our third pack here. Black Ritual. Chaos Greed and Degenerate Circuit. So these are all removal cards. Um... Control of this card pays 500 points. Whenever a monster will be returned to the hand, it is removed from play instead. That's pretty crazy. And our guaranteed super rare is... BAM! We're using my... Ooh, Black Skull Dragon. I like it, I like it. So we really want to get glossy or prismatic, though, for those foil cards. But yes, the Black Skull Dragon. That is cool. Um, if I were to be pick and choosy, I'd, I guess we want three skilled red magicians. So that's the guy we want three of. Also, obviously, three disc bladers. I think that guy is extraordinary for Yami's deck. Yami Yugi's deck using Yami. And then uh, a couple big bang shots and two summon skulls. But we'll, we'll get there eventually. Okay. So now it's time for ten packs and one guaranteed super rare. Here we go, guys. Dimension Distortion. Like when we play monster special summon to your field, you can only activate if there's no cards in your grave, though. Transform here, degenerate circuit. All right, combo master. I like these guys. This is like the evolved form of the regular combo, dude. Prime material falcon. Uh, it's okay. Transforming sphere, return soul and degenerate unit. Chain thrasher, pot of benevolence, and magician of black chaos. And. Get a cool pick. Okay, here we go. Black Magic Ritual. B-List Soldier. You can tribute this card in one face of insect type to draw. Except B-List Soldier to draw two. Eh, it's alright. Three Karibos. Nope. Chain Thrasher. Miracle Dig. Five Roman Monsters currently for play. Return three to the grave. And Soul Absorption. When cards are banished, gain 500 for each. Okay. This is the Siemens card. I mean... 
It is what it is. <laughs> Chain Thrasher. Unicorn Beacon. Select one. Remove from play. Level 5 or lower beast or wing beast. Remove from play one card from your hand. Special summon the selected monster in attack position. This is a good card. This is a good card for duelings. Not bad. Matters how you're playing it, but still. Are we just not going to pull any freaking super rare cards? Jeez. Armageddon Designator. Pointed Red Lotus. I'm not really too big on this card. Same with this card. Goblin Recon Squad. You get a look at a random card when it deals a direct attack. And then if it's a spell... Discard it. Ooh, Winking Karibo. Here we go. Exploding Karibos. Karibo, Karibo. This is ultra rare. Prismatic, baby. Just do it. First foil. Come on, Mai. Give me those eyes. Okay, okay. It looks like it's Sonic Bird. Ooh, Ghost Rider Gustav. Oh, this guy's not bad. Once per turn, you can move play up to two spell cards from your grave. This guy gets 300 for each remove. Spell cards are a little easier to do than traps. And then also the other guy was normal traps. But still, he was a 1700, so he's just he's just better than this guy. And this guy's warrior, so there's no field spell that really combos with him at the moment. Oh, it's a super rare summon skull. You know, that'd be freaking awesome to get prismatic, by the way. Yikes. I want one of those. But yeah, very nice. We're getting summon skull already. Kind of makes me want to reset the box. No, we don't need to reset on that. Bam! Nice! Displayed rider. Glossy! Yes! Oh, baby! There we go! There we go! That is awesome. So we got a glossy super rare. Once per turn, you can target one normal trap in your grave. Banish that if you do. This guy gains 500 attack until the end of your opponent's turn. Oh, it's shoot. It's until the end of the opponent's turn? Wow. Wow. This guy's even better than I thought he was. But yeah, using this guy with Yami, or Yami on the field with Yami Yugi. Mm, perfection. Easy, easy peasy. 1900 attack, and he can be a 2400 from there. And he's glossy. Ooh, oh baby, that's nice. All right. Now let's do 12 packs in the guaranteed super. Sonic Shooter, this guy's interesting. He's four stars, he's a wing beast. Um, if there's no spell or trap cards in your opponent's side of the field, this guy can attack directly. But if he does that, the only the, the only damage they take is the original attack of this card. He's an interesting card. Gustav again, Beelis Soldier. Pointer, Return Soul, Dimensional Inversion. Three Karibos. Ooh, come on, Glossy Prismatic. Come on, my Valentine. I just realized it's my Valentine. It's like, will you be my Valentine? It's M-Y, but it's M-A-I. Oh, an ultra rare, the atmosphere. Oh, baby, that's nice. This card cannot be normal. <laughs> Whoops. Um, that card cannot be normal summon or set. It can only be special summon by removing play two of your monsters on the field and one monster in your grave. So a good card to use for a deck that you're removing cards. And then uh, once it's special summoned, you can target one of your opponent's face-up monsters and equip it to the card. It gains attack and defense equal to that monster. Relinquish type card. Very good. Um, especially good in certain decks. And here's Smorg. Um, the good Smorg, because then there's the bad Smorg, right? Um, this guy cannot be special summoned. You can only use it by tributing... Oh, no. If you tribute, only win monsters. Each player takes 1,000 damage during each of the end phases. This card remains fixed on the field. The damage is decreased by 5 for each spell or trap card they control. It's not a bad card. It's not a bad card. It, if it's used correctly, that's for sure. Magic Ritual, Chain Thrasher, Dimensional Inversion, Gustav, Combo Fighter, and Sonic Duck Rare. This is a rare. 1700 normal monster. And uh, I actually used to like this card. I would look at it and just, I don't know. It's just Sonic Duck. <laughs> I don't know. The duck which can walk at sonic speeds. Sometimes he cannot deal with his incredible sp pace and loses control. Yeah, I would lose control walking at that speed too. And nice, Soul Absorption Glossy. And are we just, I don't know, I can't complain. We got a, we got a ultra rare, the atmosphere. Uh, activate this card, targeting one monster on each side of the field. Banish those targets. Interesting. Yeah, so this is the card that works well if your monster that gets banished has some sort of combo. Because you're banishing your opponents and yours. The whole problem is though, return those banished monsters when this card's destroyed in the position they were in. So, the thing is, though, you can move and play face down monsters on your opponent's side. This is a good card if you use it right. That's for sure. But it can be easily stopped by Twister. 
Combo Master, Magician of Black Chaos again. Come on, we need that Glossy. Nice, my Valentine. Ooh, we got a Glossy Rare. <gasps> it's a Glossy card in the back, too. <laughs> Here we go. Adhesive Explosive Glossy. Yeah, like I said, I'm not a big fan of this card, but we'll check out its effect here. We got a glossy super rare again, so this is this is awesome. We already have a really good pack opening. Before damage cal, if this card is attacked uh, by an opponent's monster and face down defense, at the start of the damage step, equip this card to the attacking monster. Then, during your opponent's next standby phase, destroy the monster that this is equipped to. During your opponent's next standby. So if it attacks that, it dies next turn. It's a really bad man-eater bug. Yeah. It looks kind of cool though. I didn't realize it looked so cool. It looks kind of like, like a little robot targeting mechanism. Um, it's a little better than I thought it'd be. So if it's damage step, that means their attack's already gone through, I believe. And then um, then they just die at the beginning of your opponent's next turn. So it's not that bad. Man your bug would be way better, but it's not that bad. Oh, we got some blue lights. Rising energy super rare. There we go, there we go. Now we just need the skilled red magician, and then we can just reset the box. Unicorn beacon, come on, skilled red magician. Ooh. Guaranteed super rare. Bam! Adhesive explosive. Alright, alright. Alright, you guys, here we go. Guaranteed super and ultra and 36 packs. Heart of the cards, guide us. Localized tornado, different dimension gate. We're looking for that prismatic, man. That is... That is the life of the game right here. Oh, here's the here's the first evolution of the combo fighter. Um, oh, the other one's combo master. Is that what it is? But yeah, chain link, two or more happens. That's easy to do, by the way. Main, occurs in your main phase one. This guy can attack twice. That's not bad. Too bad he's a warrior. That wacky magic. Oh, man. That wacky magic. I love it. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Which is storage black magic ritual glossy we want glossy dark magician chaos black magician chaos whirlwind weasel flip your opponent cannot activate any spell or traps for the rest of the turn combo fighter ooh kuza kuza ku oh man I can't believe they put this guy in here if this card is on the field is tributed it doesn't say tribute for a tribute summon so it's tributed in general and sent to the grave you can add a level four or lower wind monster from your deck or grave to your hand except kuza kuza ku you can only use that effect once per turn. So that's cool. Glossy. Where's the glossy? Deck? Chaos Greed's not bad, by the way. If you can only activate this card, four more of your uh, cards are currently removed from play. Oh, and there are no cards in your grave. That's kind of hard. Uh, draw two cards from your deck. That wacky magic. <laughs> Three Kribos. They're baiting us. Be less soldier. All right, come on. Where's those super rare cards? Ooh, Shrine of Miss, Miss Valley. Uh, we'll check that card out again if you pull it. You gotta read that. Point of the Red Lotus, Degenerate Circuit, cards are bounced, they're removed. Dimension Distortion, Combo Fire, Kuja Kuja Ku, again. Big Shrine of Mist Valley, okay, here we go. Once per turn, this card's pretty good. Once per turn, when a wind monster is destroyed by a card effect and sent to the grave, except during the damage step. So, it's not by battle, but it's destroyed by a card effect in general, so it could be either player. So remember that. So you can actually use your own card uh, Icarus attack, I think it says tribute, but I don't know. Just an example would be destroy your own monster, destroy something your opponents. This wood card would go off. Um, special summon one level three or lower wind monster from your hand or deck. Wow, and its effects are negated. This is a good card. All right, we have Sonic Shooter. Nice, that was a uh, Galassi Sonic Shooter. We got another Samorg. Like I said, card's not bad. 2700 wind monster that has a cool effect. Dig Unicorn Beacon. Sonic Shooter, Combo Fire, Kuja Kuja Ku. Alright, Kribos. Really? Don't do me like this. Dimensional Inversion. Hey, another Sonic Duck. Sometimes he loses himself at the pace he's at. Are we not going to get any foils? Two Glossy Dimensional Inversions. Winking Karibo, Exploding Karibo, and a Prismatic card. My Valentine. No. Big Bang Shot, super rare. There we go. All right, we got the Big Bang. Ooh, more Karibos. They're winking. They're exploding. It's time. 
Glossy Beelis Soldier. Man, did we should we have pressed that earlier or something? I feel like there's got to be some sort of technique to these Karibos. Sonic Duck again. Ooh, Mai likes it. Birdface Super Rare. Mai's like, yeah, that's my that's my kind of card right there. The Winged Beast. The Birdface. Birdface. Nice. So when this card is sent to the graveyard as a result of battle, add a Harpy Lady from your deck to your hand. More Karibos. Ooh. Mai's like, let's look at this. Not glossy, but it is an ultra rare Desert Trooper. There we go. So we got both ultras. That's nice. Uh, cannot be normal some set, and then remove two win, one earth, and then discard card, destroy a spell or trap on the field. Ooh! It's destroy a spell or trap on the field, so you can destroy your own spell or trap card. So if you're using the atmosphere relinquished, you can destroy your material or the monster you've equipped, so you can suck up another one. Oh my gosh, can atmosphere have multiple equipment? The Siemens. Uh, we're going to have to read that. We're going to have to check out the atmosphere after this. Because I know Relinquish is one at a time, but we got some writing. Dimensional Inversion. Oh, we got some lights. Shrine of Vis Valley. There we go. Karibo's winking. They're liking it. And come on. Prismatic. <sighs> Birdface again. What? Is there two of each super rare? Wait a minute. There must be two of each. Pot of Benevolence, Glossy. Nice. That wacky magic. Oh, my likes it. Some more. Oh, she's, she's bringing the heat. It's heating up. The Siemens. That wacky magic. Gotta stop. Alright, you guys. Here we go. Or one weasel transforming shrine. That wacky magic. <laughs> oh man. Black magic. That wacky magic. <laughs> you have to say it every time you pull it. How do we pull two bird faces? So we pulled two bird faces, a big bang shot, and a desert twister. I know what happened. I have the box on auto reset. Whoops. I gotta turn that off. Oh no. So the box auto reset when it pulled the ultra rare. Alright, come on. We have three bird faces. Oh gosh. Guaranteed ultra rare, so we want we want the atmosphere prismatic right here, right now. All right, desert trooper. Either, either way, it doesn't matter which one we get. <laughs> That's funny. I had it on auto reset. Oh no, I made a mistake. I'm sorry, guys. So bulk purchase settings. That's where it's at. When there are no ultra rares in the card box, auto reset. Yikes. So what we need to put on is bulk purchase says when there are no super rares in the card box. Auto reset. What if there's an ultra rare left though? Anyways, the atmosphere. This card cannot be normal summer to set. Must first possess some business. Once per turn, you can target one face of the monster, equip this card. You can only equip one monster at a time. Okay. Alright, you guys, so just to take a quick look at what we have so far. So from that 71 pack opening, um, we got a Dusk Blade Rider, one of those. We got zero skilled red magicians. That's what I was saying. We want three of those, but I guess, you know, we got three bird faces. Because <laughs> our box reset. Yeah, no, no big deal. We learned a lesson. Big Bang Shot, Rising Energy, Summon Skull. So we didn't do bad. We got two Ultra Rares, and we got one Ultra of the Atmosphere. And, um, yeah, so next time, you guys, we'll do another... 60 pack opening 70 pack opening and that'll be fun and hopefully we can at least get two skilled red magicians next time Maybe somehow three like we did with the bird face this time. That would be nice and Once again you guys thank you so much for watching remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this Wonders of the sky box opening and please remember to check out the channel and subscribe for more videos and simply unlucky signing out